Russia's S-70 Okotnik unmanned combat aerial vehicle, which can also operate as a wingman to the Su-57 fighter, is artificial intelligence enabled and can reach outer space when fitted with suitable engines. The S-70 Okotnik is powered by an AL-31 turbojet engine and is expected to fly at 1,000 km an hour in a range of 6,000 km. It is equipped with electro-optical targeting, radio, and other types of reconnaissance equipment, with its internal base carrying a payload of 2.8 tons of weapons. It has many elements of a sixth-generation drone. In addition to low visibility and supersonic speed, it can reach high altitudes and, in the future, into outer space. It, however, depends on the engines that still need to be created, the expert said Nutov said. Nutov also directly hinted about the intended mission profiles of the Su-57, the Okotnik, and their loyal wingman manned unmanned teaming. The Su-57 can control a swarm of Okotnik drones, and this combination opens up great opportunities for solving strategic combat missions. The Hunter is made in the same way as the Su-57. And in Ukraine, Su-57 aircraft solved combat missions and returned unnoticed, Nutov added. This indicates that Su-57 and the Okotnik team would either destroy large strategic targets like North Atlantic Treaty Organization command centers and civilian military targets or ease the way for large bombers like the Tupolev Tu-160, Tu-22 or MiG-31s that can carry the KH-101 cruise missile or the Kinjal hypersonic missile to release their payload. Vladimir Artyakov, first deputy director general of the Rostec State Corporation, boasted that none of the North Atlantic Treaty Organization countries have a UCAV system that can match the Okotnik.